Hey guys, this is Balu and today in the short and quick tutorial, I will show how we can convert these animated characters into blocks in Blender using modifiers easily. So hope you guys will find the video useful and without any further delay, let's start today's video. So here I'm using Blender 3.6.5. Nice. So first of all, select everything in this default scene by pressing A on the keyboard and delete. Now let's import our animated character here. So here I got the characters from Nixamo. Just create an Adobe account, login using that Adobe account. After that, you can select any of the character you like. After that, come to this animations and look for dance. So here you will find the number of animations. So from here, I have selected this thriller part. So you can see if I play, the character got that animation. So once the animation is open, click on this download. Download this in FBX format and click on this download button. So now let's import our download character here. So go to this file, import. It is an FBX file. So select this FBX and locate the file. So here I got that file. So select the file and click on this import FBX. So here you can see we got the character. So I will increase the scaling. So select the armature here, press S and increase the scaling here. So here this animation, I think 560 frames, 566 frames. So I will change the timeline to 566. So now select the armature and hide it in viewport. Now let's see how we can get that blocks kind of look. So for that we need to use a modifier. So select the character, come to this modifier options, add modifier and add remesh modifier. So here we got this remesh modifier applied right. Here we got this blocks, just click on that blocks and we got our blocks on the mesh. So now we need to increase that octree depth. So let me increase this. So here you can see as I increase this number, we are getting our character. So uncheck this remove disconnected. So now we got our character in blocks. So here if you want to increase the block number, just increase this of three depth value or else you can play with the value of the scale also. You can see. So scale, I will leave this to 0.9 only. And the octree, if you want to increase this, you can change that. You can see we get more details. So for this, I will leave this to six only. So in this way, we can convert any animated mesh into blocks in Blender easily. So hope you guys have learned something new from this tutorial. If you have learned anything new, please like, share and subscribe my channel to support me. So we'll meet in the next video. Until then, signing off. Take care. Bye.